Of course, the first reaction is relief uh, because the, because our whole team, uh, the whole company, all collaborators uh, were awaiting this this result anxiously. And as you know, this is a clinical trial, and a clinical trial can be positive and it could be negative. And only when we heard that the trial is positive and very very positive, we were relieved. And and after the relief, uh, happiness. Yeah, of course, of course, the situation is is, is, is we feel a, a huge responsibility. Uh, but on the other side, I'm also happy that we are not alone. There are a number of companies uh, who will publish their results in the, in the coming weeks. Yeah, and I expect expect that many of these results will be positive because the immune responses that have been published uh, for some of the candidates are also good. Yeah, so I feel that 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 we are not alone. Yeah, so we, we will contribute at, uh, for, uh, to control this pandemic, but we will do it together with other companies. So we are we are at the moment in in in, in a uh, close uh, dialogue with, with regulators around the world. We are talking to the European Medicinal Agency. We are talking to the FDA. We are talking to Canadian Health, to the to, to the UK authorities, to the Chinese authorities, to Japanese authorities. And uh, first uh, first authorizations or, or conditional approvals could happen in the United States or in, in, in Europe. And, uh, but the earliest time point for starting supplying vaccine will most likely not be for mid of December. And this mid of December will also not mean that the situation will dramatically change. So we have to expect that, that this will be really a, a difficult winter it will become worse before it, it, it gets better. So we will feel the first reliefs in the, in the starting with March, April uh, next year. And ideally we would have a controlled, better controlled situation in mid of next, next year.